Hello and welcome. I am Shantanu Ghosh, Assistant Professor English, currently posted at Government Niranjan Keshwani College, Kota. In this lecture, we would be talking about a play called Adhi Adhure by eminent writer and a pioneer of uh, Nai Kahani movement in Hindi literature, Mohan Rakesh. Mohan Rakesh was born on 8th January 1925 in Amritsar, the undivided Punjab back then. And he is considered one of the prominent writers of Nai Kahani, as I was mentioning earlier. Uh, but before uh, he took to creative writing, he worked as a postman in the postal department. He was uh, the head of department in the Hindi department, rather, in uh, DAV College, Jalandhar. And later on, he took up creative writing, full-fledged. Uh, Mohan Rakesh is regarded as the first modern playwright in Hindi. Not only uh, modern in terms of uh, the, the thematic aspects, but also modern um, in terms of the theatrical devices. Uh, he is also the recipient of Sangeet Natak Academy Award in 1968. Uh, his major themes in writing is destiny and human predicament, infatuation with power and creativity, male egotism and narcissistic tendencies in women. Talking about his contribution to Hindi literature uh, in general and Hindi plays and Hindi dramas in particular. Dr. Govind Chakrit, in his book, Adhunik Hindi Nataka Agradut, Mohan Rakesh said, he brought Hindi play out of the closed, lightless rooms, took it beyond the obsession with age-old romantic and unrealistic concerns into a new era of realism. That is high praise. And the discussion about Mohan Rakesh can never be complete without the discussion of his contribution to, to Hindi literature and especially Nai Kahani. Let us talk about Nai Kahani a bit. Uh, exponents uh, Writers like Mohan Rakesh, Bhishma Sahani, Nirmal Verma, Kamleshwar, Rajendra Yadav, etc. They they started uh, a literary movement during 19 uh, you know 50s and uh, early 1960s called Nai Kahan with uh, new ethos. Writers believe that art could not be alienated from material world uh, and hence thought and emotion are equally important in the context of Nai Kahani. As students uh, of literature, you are well aware of the fact uh, that there had been a movement called Art for Art's Sake. But Nai Kahani is uh, the the if not opposite but you know uh, on the contrary nai kahani believes that art is for for life you know it should be a commentary on on the life and times of people so uh, that that's where you see the concern of the writers in 
during this uh, particular literary movement called nai kahani that the characters as well as the plots or as well as uh, the themes that these uh, writers took up in their uh, creations were uh, concerned with ordinary people real people living in society their problems so there are some aspects of nai kahani we need to uh, understand first is uh, nai kahani deals with the disintegration of middle class family uh, the the uh, traditional indian family you know the the joint family system the modern world saw the disintegration of that 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 system and now um, you know from joint families to uh single family the and then and the the problem the the, the positives and the negatives of uh, and that disintegration number 2 the nai kahani deals with the emergence of working women is this very important yes it is because the the paradigms uh are shift you see a paradigm shift there uh because gender roles are somewhat uh the traditional gender roles you know man being the the uh, sole breadwinner of the family taking care of the uh the the uh, work and concerns outside uh, the home and women are managing their home and household affairs but that seems to be changing nowadays and nai kahani deals with this aspect nai kahani also deals with the erosion of values because uh, morality and values happen to be something that you know was the core of uh, they were the core things that you know people uh, were attached to now we don't see uh, that very much and if somebody is attached to you know moral values he is uh, probably not modern enough and in this modern world uh, everybody uh, is has that sense of insecurity and nai kahani deals with that why that insecurity Be- because you know um, nai kahani uh, deals with the the modern man devoid of you know any traditional uh, support he doesn't get any traditional support that's why everybody is, is uh, there is a uh, prevailing melancholia loneliness and anxiety and these problems are uh, according to these writers um, these problems are arising out of rapid urbanization uh, mohan rakesh uh, was uh, a writer who dealt with all these aspects of nai kahani in his creation now let's move on to his major works uh among his novels uh, there is andhere band kamre written in 1961 na aane wala kal 1968 Antaral is uh, in 1972 and Wakalama Khuda 1974 among his uh, notable plays are Aasad ka ek din written in 1958 Lehru ke Rajhans 1963 and of course uh, the the book we are dealing with uh, right now is Aadhe Adhure uh, written in 1969 uh mohan rakesh uh is a very important playwright let us deal with um the the salient aspects of his writing one first is uh, uh, mohan rakesh says stories plot 
the plots deal with uh, pain and suffering of modern man in a complex modern world uh it is uh, number 2 mohan rakesh believes in uh, the expression of emotions directly and truthfully so he is uh, uh, not somebody who who likes to mince his words uh, too much so his his expression um are very very direct his emotions are very pure whatever uh, he expresses through his uh, writings or uh, through the dialogues of his characters uh his is the voice of the broken tired and lost human beings caught in the quagmire of uncontrollable situations and desperately seeking the true meaning of life so you are aware of uh, the the uh, tendencies of the modern era and in this modern era uh, every every sensible uh, writer or literary personality is concerned about you know um the the search of true meaning of life because you know you are aware of the fact that now the the age old or traditional value systems the the religion you know the these things uh, don't offer any solace for uh, uh modern man so the 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 journey of modern man is probably the search uh, for identity you know um, search for meaning in life next is uh characters uh in the stories of mohan rakesh his characters are individuals taken uh, from uh, predominantly from middle class society but they are individuals as well as representative of uh, their class and they are their types every character that he portrays in his uh, plays or whatever it is uh, novel expresses uh, a distinct uneasiness and discomfort uh, because his focus is on the hollowness the emptiness of the urban life and mohan rakesh depicts the transition of values in the uh, changing society of india this is uh, the first lecture and on the second uh, lecture we would be discussing uh, aadhe adhure and uh, it's plot thank you